gaming. Do you, who buys this? Stop supporting these brands. They give you rubbish. The fake fettuccine carbonara and in the microwave. I haven't told my mom, my dad, my nonna, my family that I'm doing this. It's time to do it. Don't worry about the brand, okay? We're not talking about the brand here because everywhere you are in the world, you do get this piece of garbage, okay? 400 grams of garbage. What is fettuccine carbonara, huh? Or creamy sauce, bacon, mushrooms, huh? What is this, huh? Is this a Gordon Ramsay creation? Good source of protein. Okay, what are you trying to sell me here? No artificial colors or flavors. I mean, can you believe you can make carbonara in the microwave or in the oven? Huh? Have you ever experienced this? I never experienced this in my life. How can you do that? I want to ask Uncle Roger if you can actually make egg fried rice in the oven. Huh? Can you warm up egg fried rice in the oven? You can't. So you basically have to put this for five minutes in the microwave. And I'm going to do it now and I'll see how it's going to turn out. Now, what's inside this carbonara? You have to make it fresh. How can you put it in the freezer? Anyway, creamy sauce. What is that? You don't put cream in the carbonara. Bacon, no bacon, no mushrooms, okay? At this point, I would also say, what are the peas, huh? If, if you're following Gordon Ramsay recipe, you're missing out the peas. Sodium, very high in sodium. Anyway, nutritional information, I am not good with that. I'm not a nutritionist, so I can't discuss. But if you are, write a comment below and tell me if this good, is this good for us or bad? Now, ingredients, carbonara sauce. What is that? What is it, huh? It's a mix of eggs and pecorino and pasta water. But this is not, this is not, this is not, this is not, this is not what it is. Bacon, 4%. 4% cheddar cheese, cheddar cheese in carbonara. I have never heard that in my life. This was $5, five Australian dollars, and you're putting me cheddar cheese? Huh? I want three kilos of pecorino in there. Milk solids. I am not a baby. What are you giving me, milk solids? Butter. There is no butter in carbonara. Onion. Onion. What is the onion for? Ah, you're making a ragu. Thickener. Preservatives. Salt. That's okay. Chicken flavor. Chicken flavor in carbonara. Five dollars in the freezer. You're paying for chicken flavors and onions. Garlic. How can I say? You use all these other ingredients. Garlic maybe is the best thing you use. Vegetable oil. Come on, use the extra virgin. Mushroom flavor. Mushroom flavor in carbonara. We are not making a mushroom pasta. Thickna, which is preservative. Spice, spice. Vegetable gum. What is that? Stung tang gum. Gum, gum, gum. What do you need the gum for, huh? The only chewing gum I eat. I eat it when I'm, I have nothing else to do. Cooked fettuccine, 45%, and parsley to finish it off. Are you kidding me? Do you, who buys this? If you buy this, stop now. Stop supporting these brands. They give you rubbish. They give you rubbish for your stomach. What is fun here is that they make it look pretty in the picture. Look at the picture here. So when you see this in the freezer, you say, oh my God, it looks fantastic. Oh my God, I want to eat it. Wow, it's going to turn out like this. <laughs> it's not going to turn out like that. It's going to turn out like this. Oh, and this is what you get. A piece of garbage. 400 grams piece of garbage. I'm going to put it in the freezer just for you, okay? This piece of garbage is going to go in the freezer right now just because I love you. And I'm going to eat it because I love you, okay? Let's do it. Five minutes. The fake fettuccine carbonara in the microwave. I haven't told my mom, my dad, my nonna, my family that I'm doing this. I don't even know why I'm doing this new reaction, eating this rubbish. I don't know why I do it. I hope... Uh, I hope that you guys will stop eating this, if you eat this. And if you have some family, some friends with this, tell them to stop. This is bad. Stop it. Get some help. 
it takes 10 minutes to make carbonara. This goes for five minutes in the microwave and then you have to wait two to three minutes before you can eat it. If you wanna save money for carbonara, don't use guanciale, don't use pancetta, use the bagel, it's cheap. The egg, okay, I, I can say to you, use bacon, but don't eat this. Don't buy these, please don't buy these, okay? Make carbonara with eggs, okay? Pecorino. Pecorino is the best white powder you can get on the planet. I always have pecorino in my fridge. If you don't, then I'm sorry, but you haven't lived yet. <laughs> and then all you need is music, passion, and love. I love you. Time to reveal the carbonara, the frozen carbonara, and this is the garbage that you get. Look how terrible it looks. Is this something you want to eat? Does it look appetizing to you? Huh? You tell me. Does this look appetizing to you? What is nice about it? Look at that cream. The cream is tutto scoppiato. Exploded that cream. Look at this. Huh? How can you eat this? How can we eat this carbonara? How can you trust this cream? I believe it's going to make me go to the toilet straight away. Come on, guys. How can you serve this to anyone? How can you eat this? I'm gonna try it for you because I love you. This is, this is it, this is it. I mean, it is creamy, it is creamy. I'm not saying it's not creamy. Creamy, it is creamy, it is probably rich. But is it carbonara? No, it's not carbonara. Am I paying $5 for carbonara? Maybe you say, oh, that's not enough. It doesn't matter if you lose money. No, you don't wanna lose money. The most important thing here is what am I putting in my stomach, okay? There is nothing wrong with the fact this is frozen, Frozen food can be good, okay? Ready meals can be made very well. But the thing is, what pass is this, okay? Is this overcooked? It does look overcooked. What do you put in the cream? Where is the bacon? I can't even see the bacon. First, you don't put bacon, but I don't see it. Where is it? Anyway, let's do a test. Well, let's see if it's worth it. It's time to do it. Time to do it. And it's a large fork of fake carbonara. Smells like processed food. Smells like cream. No bacon. I can't smell anything else. I can't smell the onion. I can't smell the garlic. I can't smell the chicken powder, the mushroom sauce. Very creamy, very rich. So the label was right. Very bland flavors, very bland. The pasta is very, very soft, but the bacon is not crunchy. The pasta is very, very moist, very soft. It's not al dente, it's uh, a bit overcooked. But to be honest, the pasta is not that bad. The pasta can pass the test. I think the pasta is all right. What the problem is here is each, each single ingredient is pretty bad. I think the salt is the only good ingredient and the pasta. The pasta is not that bad, but everything else is wrong. Like, you, you, it might be appealing if I put it in a plate, maybe it looks nice, but everything inside it's wrong. Not only the recipe is wrong, but it's wrong for you to eat. It's all trash, it's garbage. It does not belong to your stomach. It belongs to your trash. I have it one more time, just in case I made a mistake, I try it again, just to make sure it's bad. Mm. Outside, can you hear outside? The garbage man arrived. He came to pick up this. This belongs to the garbage. That's where it's going. Hey, garbage man, I'm coming. Do, do not feed yourself this. Please don't. Find the time, okay, to cook. 10 minutes, 15 minutes the most. I've got plenty of recipes on my YouTube channel. 10 minutes, 15 minutes recipes. Easy stuff. That, so much better than this, okay? Do not put this in your stomach, okay? It's not good for you, okay? I love you and that's the reason why I'm doing this video for you. That's the reason why I'm going to throw up now for you because I don't want this to reach my stomach. This needs to get out of my body before it gets to my stomach. Oh, I can feel it. Okay, I have to go. I won't be long, won't be long, won't be long, won't be long, won't be long. And this is where you belong. Go there, please, and don't come back. Never come back into my life. Never. Best thing you can do right now is go to my channel, find the carbonara. I've got two versions. I've got the carbonara classic, and I've got the modern carbonara where I don't use the entire egg. I use egg yolks, and it's a bit creamier. 
okay? Follow my recipe of carbonara and you will be so happy. It's a 10 minutes pasta, it's quick, it's easy, and I promise you're not gonna get a stomachache. You don't have to go and throw up in the toilet to get it out of your system. You wanna keep it in your system. <laughs> Guys, don't do this to yourself. Thank you so much for watching this episode. I will see you in the next Vincenzo's Plate video recipe. E ora si mangia. Vincenzo's Plate. Thank you guys, thank you for watching and do not do this to yourself.